this morning and I did my hair and makeup because I'm finally filming a Nikki and Gabby video today and then I realized why am I not vlogging today? Today is gonna be a crazy day. So let me just go through what's going on today. So my, my closet is a wreck. Like my house is such a mess because I was in LA, then New York Fashion Week, now I'm home and I'm going on vacation tomorrow. So I just need to clean my closet. My closet is just a mess. I also got so many new Easter decorations because when I'm home from vacation next week, I'm gonna decorate the Cottage Palace for Easter and I'm really excited because it's my first year in this house where everything's literally pink and girly and I get to like just make my Easter princess fantasy. So I'm going to give you guys a little home goods haul in this vlog as well. You're going to see some BTS of Nikki and Gabby filming. The Nikki and Gabby video has to do with that drama going on online with Hailey and Selena at the moment. So I'm going to talk about that in this video as well. I also have my beautiful mess fragrance Easter photo shoot this evening for the Easter promos. And all in all, I also have to pack for vacation tomorrow. So it's going to be a very long day. I know you guys love a day in my life type videos. This should be a good vlog. But without further ado, let's get into this day in my life video. So this is what it looks like right now. I'm gonna do an overview. It's a beautiful mess. Okay, booze. So I cleaned my closet and it's looking so cute. I'm going to do a little Easter decoration haul for you guys, but before I do that, I am going to show you the new swimsuits that I got for vacation. I just started packing for vacation, but I haven't opened my new swimsuits yet, so I'm going to do a quick little swimsuit try on haul for you. I just want to thank Cupshe for sponsoring this vlog and just so you guys know everything that I'm wearing is linked down below and I have a code for you if you guys want to get a discount on your swimsuits. Overall I've seen so much about Cupshe online and I have to say I was very impressed when I opened my package. This first swimsuit that I'm trying on is this black one piece and this second swimsuit is this two piece that you could tie any which way. I decided to tie it like this. I thought it was super fun. It looks like a really strappy one piece and this swimsuit comes in different colors. I chose this like tie-dye blue color but it also comes in like a lavender pink color. This swimsuit reminds me of something I would wear when I was like growing up, but an adult version. And not only that, but this color reminds me of Latere. Like I feel like I'm a walking Latere shopping bag and it's just so cute. I had to grab this like pink scarf that I own to see how the pink and pistachio green look together. And oh my goodness, I felt like a little Barbie doll in this one piece. I personally love a good white two-piece swimsuit and I really really love how modest this bikini is along with their other swimsuits. I noticed that all of their swimsuits are just really really good quality and they all share like this modest vibe that I really love. And speaking of which, this last swimsuit that I'm trying on for you guys is another black one piece and I love how there's like sexy elements still but it still like is nice and full coverage. All of Cupshe swimsuits are already very, very good prices, so my code down below is going to make that extra affordable for you guys, and I don't know about you, but I have heard my friends talk about this website for a very long time now, so if you're like my friends and you're looking for swimsuits for spring break or for summer, definitely go down below in my description box and use my code, or if you found a swimsuit that I'm wearing in particular that you want, I've linked that down below as well, and let's get back into the vlog. All right. I went to go film a TikTok and Pennsylvania problems, a train's going by so I have to wait until the train goes by because I'm talking in this TikTok. I'm actually doing my Goodwill haul for TikTok. I want to break it up a little bit since I am doing Easter haul for this channel. I want to do my Goodwill haul for TikTok. <laughs> Okay, boo, so 
so I'm about to shoot my beautiful nice campaign photos for the Gabster season, the Easter season. Um, oops. And Peep is going to be featured in the photo shoot. Hey, baby. Guys, just so you know, you're in a cupboard. <laughs> oh my God, I love these. Oh, we definitely have it. So we definitely <laughs> have it. Okay, boo, so I'm going to give you a TJ Maxx Easter haul and some Bath & Body Works. I really was just running errands to get a new suitcase for vacation. And of course, per usual, I ran into some Easter decorations and I was like, I got to start shopping for Easter. So without further ado, I'm going to show you guys what I got for Easter. I actually want to start with this. It's my favorite thing ever. I already have Easter bunnies. And because of that, I have so much easter decorations it's not even funny because i love my bunny so much i always want bunnies on everything in my house in the past i bulk bought like easter stuff because i always want items with bunnies on them so the first item that i got is this really beautiful the the ring lights making this look white light pink and gold egg it reminds me of the big golden eggs in willy wonka it's like a marie antoinette easter egg then i got these really cute dish towels for the kitchen my kitchen is like pink now so i loved how it had pops of pink on this and the pink bows on the bunnies and their little foofy cotton tails i feel like this looks super retro and vintage then i got these bunny paper plates i'm always having people over so i love to have paper plates on deck whenever friends come over i love the scallops along the edges and the little pink flowers and the bunny in the middle then i got these easter egg napkins look how pretty like it looks like a vintage pattern, like a vintage wallpaper or something. So I went to Bath and Body Works and I have three faucets in my house. So actually right now downstairs, I have this one. I got several hip hop hooray, cottontail, cake pop, um, hand soaps. I love anything that smells like cake, you guys know this. So I got two of these and then I got one of the Happy Easter Tutti Fruity candy soaps for the upstairs bathroom. And because I'm going away, I got Happy Easter Tutti Fruity Candle Shower Gel with a little chick on it. And then I got the Happy Easter Tutti Fruity Candy Body Lotion in this cute travel size. And last but not least, I got Sweet Carrot Cake. It's this really cute blush pink candle with like a chrome finish. I love that this is like a carrot cake scent, but it's like a light pink candle. I feel like this needs to be in this room. It's just so cute. Okay, boo, so I'm gonna wrap up this vlog because I have to pack and I wanna edit this before I leave. So before I close this vlog, I do wanna talk about Nikki and Gabby, obviously, because you saw we were filming behind the scenes of Nikki and Gabby in this vlog. So as you guys know, Nikki and I had a podcast and I say had because we're no longer filming the podcast. And there's like so many reasons behind that. But one of the main reason being is that the company we were working with wanted us to have our sets in Pennsylvania and there was just no room for growth with our sets being in Pennsylvania because no offense like who's gonna come all the way to Pennsylvania to be a guest so Nikki and I want to take the podcast to like a different level when we resume and put the studios in LA so that we could have celebrity guests the company we were with had a producer with us from around the area so even if we wanted to we couldn't move or relocate the show and without celebrity guests literally all Nikki and I could do is talk about ourselves and be repetitive and just like talk about our experiences and at the end of the day Nikki and I just like 
are tired of sitting there talking about ourselves over and over again and the creative control was beyond our control because we had to pre-film all those episodes so we had no choice but to talk about ourselves. I know a lot of you guys clocked that during New York Fashion Week Nikki and I like weren't following each other and stuff so there was just there was definitely a lot of drama that went around Nikki and I during this time so but know that Nikki and I are doing much better and we're gonna start filming weekly again for Nikki and Gabby and I'm actually really excited to do that I really miss doing that I wasn't finding any joy and just like sitting in a chair there's only so much inspiration I can get from just like sitting in a chair talking about myself like I love to just you know try products or do challenges and it trial and error you know I just felt like throughout that process I felt super burnt out and there's just more to it Nikki and I are very very grateful to have done the podcast you know you live and you learn but we're ready to just start uploading like normal videos again it is what it is so that's it for this video I'm gonna take an Easter bath right now and then edit and go on vacation tomorrow. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next fancy vlog.